Now let's have a look at the next question which came in the year CAC 2021 slot 2. I'll read the question well. The question says for all the real values of x, I repeat, for all the real values of x, the range of the function f of x is given by x square plus 2x plus 4 divided by 2x square plus 4x plus 9. And the question is we have to find the range of this function of f of x. Clear? Now let's assume this given uh, fraction in the form of n by d. Now whenever you get a question in which you have to find the range of the given uh, function, the only and the first thing that we need to do is to draft the numerator and denominator in the similar format. Now let's try to draft the numerator in some format. The numerator is x square plus 2x plus 4. This is something that we can rewrite as x plus 1 the whole square plus 3. On the other hand you have got the denominator which is given to as 2x square plus 4x plus 9. Let's read enough this to be in the form of 2 times x plus 1 the whole square plus 7. Now this is the same question in the form of f of x function what we have got. Now still the numerator and denominator not, does not have anything common apart from x plus 1 the whole square. Now let's try to uh, break 7 into, into some form. Let me rewrite this as x plus 1 the whole square plus 3 divided by 2 times x plus 1 the whole square plus 3 and then add 1 in the end. Clear? Now at least this time x plus 1 the whole square plus 3 will be a common part. And let me assume that to be as common constant k. I am saying x plus 1 the whole square plus 3 let's assume to be as k. So the whole expression will become k times divided by 2k plus 1. Clear? This is what we will get. Right? Now what is the value of k? k is nothing but x plus 1 the whole square plus 3. Now ask yourself what is the minimum value that k can get. The minimum value of k will come when x is equal to 0 and that value will be 3 and this range will become 3 by 7. So I said uh, we assume x to be as 0 you got the minimum value of k to be as 3 and k upon 2k plus 1 will become 3 by 7. Now obviously this is one of those values which will definitely come. So the minimum value of this range will be 3 by 7. Maximum that totally depends on the value of x what you assume. But if you look at the kind of pattern that we can make out of it, um, the maximum the value or let's say the larger the value of k it would be, the minimum will be the significance of this one. For example, if k is 1000, uh, 2k plus 1 will become 2001. If k is 1 lakh, this will become 2 lakh 1. Clear? This will obviously, uh, any value, this will obviously be any value which is less than 0.5. I repeat, this will definitely be any value which is going to be less than 0.5. Now, suddenly you cannot assume uh, to be at exactly 0.5 because this denominator is always one more uh, than twice the numerator. Now, the larger the value would be, the larger the value of k would be, the approximately closer the value of this would be close to 0.5 but this will always be less than 0.5. So the range what you can define is, it's going to be taking a minimum value of 3 by 7 to a maximum value will be slightly less than 1 by 2. And hence, the answer for the given question what you can mark, I repeat, the answer for the given question what you can mark will be option number B to be the final answer for this question.